Zelt Parker here with, uh, I'm gonna try and do a full playthrough of Dead Rising, the original one. But real quick, let me say, I'm starting it at level 50 because it's gonna be so difficult to start from level 1. So I'm gonna start it at level 50 and not gonna use any of the special weapons unless it's absolutely necessary. I'm just gonna keep it as chill as I can. Um, I haven't recorded a video on YouTube in a long, long time. Uh, not like a gaming video. I've been uploading my Yu-Gi-Oh ones, but those are pre-recorded from like two years ago. So it is 3.20 on October 4th, 2018. Let's do this. I, I'm a big fan of uh, Dead Rising, by the way. So much I even wanted to get a tattoo of like the logo at one point. So I've got every Dead Rising game there is. I got all the DLC, whole nine yards. Love Dead Rising. I was started playing it when I was a little kid and it was incredibly, incredibly difficult at a certain point. And uh, I hope all my audio matches up and everything the proper way. We're gonna have to see. I guess that's what I was wearing last, clothing wise. Say, buddy, you mentioned something about research for a story. That's right. Got a tip that something big's happening. In a nowhere little town like that? They sure didn't mention anything about it on TV. Yeah, well, I'm freelance, pal. I don't make my living waiting for the TV to tell me what to cover. <laughs> I'm, uh, I got my T. I'm using the headphones in the computer to record, and now I've got my is. TV volume almost all the way down. <laughs> so I'm getting a delay in audio. Population 53,594. Distinguishing characteristics, jack shit. <laughs> About the only thing to do in this town is kill time at the shopping mall. I'll do some killing in the shopping mall. What was that? The army? Yeah. <laughs> Looks like taking a helicopter was the way to go. I bet they got all the roads blocked off by now. I want to get shots of the whole town before the National Guard finishes roping it off. Take me over the main street. I'm going to try and record for a good little minute. Like, I'm thinking like an hour at least. Because you got to play this game. It's based on a timeline. So you actually have to play for a set. Seven hours at least, I believe. Alright. B zooms in. Or at... Yeah, and A's out. So you don't have to do this part, but I think it's nice to do. Just take some quick shots. Oh, wow. It's... Brutality. Really, the pictures mostly just help you level up or whatever, and there's uh, an achievement for like finding set pictures in the game. Like, they'll have a little sticker on them called a PP sticker, and you get specific points for shooting those. Sure is. Oh, they done got them. Eat them up, eat them up, eat them up. Look at all those people. What the hell is happening here? I have no idea. But one thing's for sure. Whatever's going on down there, it's not business as usual in this town. I wonder if there's people in the box. Some dark ass windows. There's got to be, because otherwise they wouldn't be standing there wanting to eat them. It's 
a nice town. Now that I vaguely design games, I'm just looking at it, thinking about all the assets and everything that went into this shit. Tornado. I had the advantage of knowing it was going to happen, though. Oh, yeah, you have a limited number of pictures. Yeah, get up the smoke. I recommend it. Take us down. We have to check out that building. Huh? Where? Right below us. Oh, she popping them off. Where? You could bolt through them. Look how slow they are. I would zigzag right through them. How'd she even get up there? That building over there? She done got herself caught. Oh, she threw a gun. She's like, hey, help me, help me. Oh, man. I thought she was following when I took that. No, 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 no. Oh, well. I was curious to see if he was gonna fall right behind. Take me there. Center of the town. Man, I hope this is all recording properly. I'm also using like a or an Android head headphone, so wall? it picks up all the sound in the room. You gotta be kidding me! Man, you are nuts! All right, listen. Don't forget to come back for me. As long as you're not dead, Fred. It's Frank. Frank West. Remember that name, because the whole world's going to know it in three days, when I get the scoop. All right. Whoa! Shit! Chop the fight. Damn, what was in that case anyway? I just saw him have it open. Get us back down to that rooftop! I know I'm going to get my butt chewed out for this. Going down. Hopefully he broke his legs. That was a higher jump. Could have broke his legs. He didn't look fit enough for that. Hello there. Huh? You're the reporter, aren't you? Yeah. You came alone. Yeah, I'm freelance. You know, go on the battlefield alone, no crew. So, uh, what's going on around here anyway? You came by helicopter, didn't you? What did you see from the sky? Are you blind? What did you just see? Well... You just saw me jump out of it. If it were just a riot, I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. The moratorium on information getting out is a little extreme, in my opinion. There's uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Doesn't sound like civil disobedience. It's too quiet. <laughs> Almost as if 
Everyone's already dead? Yeah. So why don't you just tell me already? What's going on? I think you'd better see for yourself. This, my friend, is hell. Creepy. Oh, shit. September 19th, 12 o'clock. Uh, I get a watch and I gotta be back there at 12, it says for the helicopter. Looks like you're the only journalist that made it out here. I'm looking forward to some nice pictures. Hee hee hee. Good. Well, I can't say it's nice, but there's a picture for you. The somersault kid. I don't know how to do, like, set skills or anything. I haven't played this game in a good while. Saving your game. So you save your game by sleeping or using the bathroom. So let's go ahead and take us a little nap. Save break, whatever. Yes. Bunch of empty rooms. I think these do something, I thought. Yeah. I think that's my standard outfit, maybe. Yeah. A uh, sharp white one. Hmm. And some sunglasses, or well, some sort of glasses. Yeah. Oh no, that's my standard outfit. I'll just stick with that for now, though. My, don't mind my cat in the background. Well, my wife's cat. It never shuts up. Kitty, hush. If I throw something at the door, what she'll run away. World. She just got carjacked. At least have clothes yeah. too. Oh, sharp and tan. Yeah. Was this what I was wearing? It looks like it. Yeah. I think I yeah. like this one best of those three. Now see, over here is where I have some special equipment for killing 53,000 blah 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 monsters in the game. You get this. Get some special clothes too. And since this is a Capcom game, it's a Capcom reference. I can play like a prisoner. I'm just showing off what Clothes there are real fast. Hmm. Hockey mask. That's probably more. This is all I have. Oh, and Mega Man shoes. Okay, let's get rid of those. Those look stupid. I'm gonna stick with this look right here. Oh, wait. Did I get this one? Oh, shit. Okay. I'll roll with this for now. You walk so much slower if I wasn't already level 50. And you have a lot less item slots and everything. It, it would be much more of a challenge, but I'm not in it for the challenge. I mean, I'm in it to see myself play it and enjoy it later down in life. And also to give tips or whatever for future players. Madonna, hey, quit screwing around! Oh, oh, oh. Have you seen my baby? I can't live without my precious little sweetie doggy. Oh, where is? 
Where's my Madonna? Where is she? Oh, oh. I would not approach that dude asking him with that look on his face. Or mask. My precious Madonna. He got a staring problem, don't he? Hey, this is no time to ogle pretty girls, son. You looking to get yourself eaten alive by zombies? What? Did you just say zombies? Take a look out there. If those ain't zombies, what would you call them? Mm, high quality right there. Uh, he got no. There's been more and more of them since last night. Now, they're all that's out there. Hey, look on the bright side. <laughs> zombies. Why did he elbow? Stupid and slow. We should be safe in here. All right, then. Feel like making yourself useful? Take a look around the mall. Bring anything we can use for the barricade back here. On delay. Come on, pronto. Damn, he went right to taking orders from him. A little bitch. Frank West. Reporter, photographer, little bitch. Look at all them zombies. Perfect. Chris, Freddy, Ryan. Also, like, it takes note of every single character or, like, NPC in the game. Madonna. If I can't get a good photo angle with. Hmm. Oh, I got Brian and Lindsay. Come this way. When anyway, he couldn't have gotten out of the mall. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even get these two way over here. What the fuck? Perfect. It's a nice little feature. While in some uses it's not really necessary, the photography. It's just a nice little feature they didn't have to give. You know? Well, I guess for being a reporter it makes sense, but, you know. This old man penguin you... from Gotham. Stop right there! Do you have any idea what you've oh. done? Why did you summon me to this place? What are you planning? Would you calm down? I don't even know what you're talking about. What the? Kooky old man. Oh shit, I heard a crash. Madonna! My Madonna is out there! Oh, this dumb old bitch. Oh yeah, there's a little dog there. How's this old woman getting the best of these two grown ass men? Zombie dog. I wonder if this came out, out around the time of Dawn of the Dead. I remember if there was a dog incident in that. Somebody risked their life for a dog or something. What in the hell are you people doing? Run! Quick, move! Get over here! Everyone, move this way! Quick, to the stairs! Move! Authoritative black man. Better do what he says. All right, let's find a weapon. That's not what I wanted. Oh no, everyone's dying. There is a trick, I don't remember. I can figure it out real quick. It's like X and, oh, oh, oh shit. I just killed that. Oh no. Hey, real quick. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, uh, status. There's a special move I want to show. It's a uh, lift up. X and A. If I can find somebody who's still alive. Ah, oh, no. Nah. I'm not going to find somebody who's still alive. Dead 
damn, I wish I hadn't let that happen. But you can literally pick somebody up and carry them all the way up there, and then as soon as the cutscene starts, they're still dead. It's really disappointing. It would have been nice to save them. Figure go ahead and ki kill a couple zombies while I'm here. Okay, okay. They want to make it difficult, so let's just get out of here. But yeah, even though you, I misused the, the Mega Man Plus, so you just got to see some action from that. I'll grab a cigarette. Staff only. I'm the only others? person that made it back. I don't know. I hope they got away. <sighs> we damn well know they all just died. Hope they got away. I saw every single one of them died. He's lying. As long as those things are in the mall, we better not use this door. Uh, what are you doing? The air ducts. They'll get us back into the mall, and apparently those things aren't smart enough to use the ducts. So they won't be a factor. <clears throat> Wait a minute. You want to get back in there? What for? We gotta eat. Hey. <sighs> nice camera. Are you a photographer? As a matter of fact, I am. Frank West, photojournalist. Could you show me some pictures? They just talked to this murdering looking psycho so casually. There it goes, oogling more. <laughs> you really seem to know what you're doing. Who are you guys, anyway? And what are you... I took that one near the entrance. That guy do something? Nope. Thanks for showing me, though. Uh, hey, we're not done talking yet. Just who are you guys? I'm Jesse. The man you saw earlier is Brad. That's all I'm authorized to tell you. Okay, then. Uptight ass. 71 hours and 7 minutes. All right, so let's check this situation out. I'm gonna grab some coffee creamer. I can't answer your questions. Even if we rounded up everyone responsible and the rest of them, I'd still have my hands full with everything else that's going on around here. Well, okay then. Otis. You ain't planning on going back down into the mall, are you? I wouldn't do that if I were you, but you young folks or something. That, well, if you're gonna at least take this transceiver with you, and you better take this map too. I got a transceiver and a mall map too. Well, guess I'm going to the rooftop. There's an achievement in, for the, in this game for surviving seven days in survival mode. And e two hours is equivalent to one in-game day, right? So that means you have to play 14 hours straight. Your health is constantly depleting. Mister! There's an old lady. Hey! 
Hey, anybody around? You, have you seen my wife, Natalie? She should still be around here. Looking for someone? I'll lend a hand. That'd be great, fella. The name's Jeff Meyer, by the way. I'm Frank. I'm a journalist. All right. And you can even... You saw how it said give? I could give him this weapon. I'm not going to. I'll watch this shit. Ah, oh, damn. So close. Jeff! <sighs> Those get your Fantastic. extra points. Look at that, 8,000. Oh, Natalie, I'll never let you go again. I'll take you to a security <laughs> roof. I was smoking, so I didn't take time to... Hold on, I want to get them anyway. I'm level 50, so I don't really care about the experience from this. Damn it. I'm doing so whack. Fuck it. Oh well. Let's take them back to the security room. Why am I injured? Oh yeah, I was fighting down there. So I killed... I'm never going to the mall again as long as I live. I've had about enough of this. 53. You get like 10,000 PP or 20,000. Oh yeah, I think it's 10,000 per person, right? Hey, it's Otis back at the security room. Let me give you a rundown on the mall's layout. Right on the other side of the warehouse, you'll find the Paradise Plaza. There's a lot of shops there, restaurants, sporting book, goods, books, you name it. It's a pretty big mall, so you probably need to use the can now and then. I, I think that's what he said. And look, you can smash boxes. Zombies, huh? Had a feeling you'd show up. Just a feeling, Frank? Ah! Oh! God, it's you. Look, don't sneak up on me. <sighs> Brad was attacked. I located him on the monitor. Oh! <clears throat> it's probably just a sprain. Gotta help Brad. Damn, she sprained her ankle that easy. All right, fine. Give me your gun. Come on. I'm the reason you just got hurt. Let me help. No, I can't let a civilian do that. That's against regulations. Yeah, well, I don't think they had zombie-infested malls in mind when they wrote those regulations, kid. You know how to use this? Kinda. Kid. I've covered wars, you know. I wouldn't hand that gun to no fucking psychopath, hockey mask motherfucker. I'm through helping you. You and I are gonna have a nice little chat. Case 101. Yeah. I prefer the baseball bat. And since I know this game pretty well, I know where to get decent weapons that aren't, you know, that nothing's as good as this bad boy right here. Watch this shit. Oh, wait, hold on. How do I use it? <laughs> I guess I don't know this game so well. Yeah. Hold on. I know this. I'm, oh, shit, I just got attacked. Hold on. You can aim somehow with the gun. 
Hello? Oh, okay. It's oh, the controls are terrible. What? This bitch is so good. But that's just to show you what it uh, looks like and sounds like. Welcome to the Paradise Plaza. Many zombies have been killed here in my history. Oh, here. Watch this. Oh, well, don't want chat. That nigga's floating. Chug the whole gallon right there. Boom. SMG. Okay, so what's my mission? Back up for Brad. Food court. Oh, and in survival mode, none of your, uh, like, in this game, there's spots where stuff is infinite. Like, you can just grab unlimited supplies of food. In survival mode, there's none of that. I like this, riding around on skateboard. Makes for fast travel. Frank, you there? It's me, Otis, the janitor. You said you were a journalist, right? I've been watching the Mars here and I got some info you might want. There's some guy wandering around in Paradise Plaza. He's carrying a camera like you. I guess he must be a photographer too. Taking pictures at a time like this, you're both crazy. I got the scoop. Okay, I got plenty of time. That blue bar represents my time to do it. Oh, what? Did the skateboard break? What just happened? It sure did. Whack. Hey, watch this. Uh, over six. Oh, I got barefoot. Look at all the little fish. Oh, shit. Okay, that's not what was supposed to happen. There you go. Perfect. Yeah, boy. Yeah, so use right trigger and then X to shoot. It's kind of stupid, but whatever. You get what you get. So over here is the food court. That's uh, Wonderland Plaza or something. Put this mow down. I'll teach you to block off the doors. Fun stuff. I like his little panic dance there. Oh, it's Carlito. Your uh, girlfriend sent me to find you. Who? Jesse? Damn it! Okay, we'll have to talk about this later. You know how to use that gun? I've never fired at a person. All right, I'll cover you from here. You need to stick to the shadows. Try to get close to the target, okay? And what am I supposed to do when I get close? Shoot his ass in the head. Be to shoot the guy. 
But if you can't do that, keep him busy dodging your bullets and stay out of trouble. Are you up to it? I'm a lot better with a camera. But yeah, I'll give it a shot. All right. Next time he reloads, I'll lay down a suppressing fire. <coughs> I'm counting on you. Make your way over there. One, two, three! No shoes. No shirt, no service. Uh, I remember this guy being kind of a nuisance. What's he just standing there for? He's letting me fuck him up. Am I hitting? What's hitting or not? Uh, who's calling me? Hold on. I don't know the number. It's probably not too important. Oops. Stop it! Oh shit! Oh shit! Stop karate kicking me! What's he using a P90? Okay, I gotta get out this dude's face. He's messing me up. Oh my lord. Okay, so I'll give you some breathing room, sir. Don't worry about that. Drink some of my coffee creamer. Get my diabetes on. Alright, fuck it, I'm breaking out the sub. Damn, he's fucking me up. There we go, fuck you. <coughs> I would have one shot at him had I used a Mega Man gun. <laughs> Got pulleys up to the roof. He's an engineer, no isn't he? Who was that anyway? I don't know. Well, thanks for your help. The name's Brad. I'm Frank West, photojournalist. And right now, I'd rather have an explanation than your thanks, Brad. Sorry. I've got nothing to tell you. That piss me off. Look. I don't know what Jesse told you. But as far as I'm concerned, we're through working together. So you cover your zombie story and leave the rest to us. You, uh, you guys are looking for someone here, aren't you? Hmm? Who is that? Where did you, you take it? You help me, I help you. I just saved this guy's ass and he ain't gonna tell me shit. I should just let him get shot up. Damn. You're one hell of a journalist, aren't you, Frank? A hot-headed, underhanded, hotshot paparazzi with nothing better to do than to invade people's privacy. I try. You got a point? <laughs> you win, Frank. Let's work together. 
Jesse and I are DHS agents. And yes, we are looking for the man in that picture. <laughs> You're with Homeland Security. Is that guy a terrorist or something? I took that picture in the entrance plaza. Right near the front door. The entrance plaza. You're sure? Hey! So do I have your permission to cover this story? Or not? Ugh. <sighs> What a great uh, answer to my question. <laughs> Gotta stay supplied with some foods. Never know what's gonna happen. in Willamette. Alfresca uh, Fresca Plaza. Oh, look at that splatter. I like that they use your pictures for the loading screens occasionally. Them up. Better watch out, bro, after you get chopped up. Brad, stop playing around. Oh, wow, it broke really fast. Oh, shit. Let's just go, man. Just kidding, I support law in somewhat manner. So he must have been security. Let's go. Now you can do the whole game and not do the story, but it will, like, right now if I wasn't doing this mission, this gate would lock, stay locked, and I'd never be able to get past it. A lot of cutscenes here in the early game, I guess. Feel like I've watched more than I've played. Sir, if you could just kindly come with us, we can wrap this whole thing up. No, I'm not leaving until you can Absolutely, guarantee sir. me if safe passage just open to this gate. Just open this gate no. for your protection. This I am not us. opening any gate. Thank you very much. I'm going to stay right Do here. Dr. Where Barnaby. Safe. Sir. Thank you and goodbye. Dr. Dr. Barnaby. Goodbye. Well, what happened? He's not a smooth talker, is he? You can't just arrest him? He turned down my offer to protect him. Said he isn't going anywhere until I can guarantee a secure route out of here. Jesse has a direct line to HQ. The first thing we need to do is to call for backup. How would I arrest him if he's freaking locked behind the thing? Frank, right now you're in the entrance plaza. Looks like you got the shutter up, and if you want to change in some fresh studs, just take what you need. All right, let's see. First off, let's, wait, is there a zombie behind me or anything? 
Okay. Case 1-4, a temporary agreement. Go, security room. Back in the security room, this should be a good time to hash things out with Brad and Jesse. Okay, so basically just go there is what I'm saying. Oh, I thought this gate was going to be open. What the fuck? I got to walk all the way back around now. Go through the food court and everything. That's stupid. I'm jousting. And I want chess. Here we go, here it is. Yeah. Explosion. Me. Oh, I guess uh, in this one, if you have the weapon still, it won't reappear. Damn, she got some air. He got, he got legs for days. I just roundhouse kick him. Let's try again. No, it didn't work. I just got hit up. <laughs> yeah, saving survivors. You know what? I got time, I think. Saving survivors is a great way to gain PP. Watch it. See me on the treadmill. See it moving at the bottom. Boom, 2,000 PP. See this sticker right here? This thing? That means it's a PP sticker. So, take the picture. Oh, wait. Hold on. Fantastic. There you go. Oh. That's a way for some quick points as well. I'm thinking about doing like. I was thinking a case per video or something, but I don't really know. I think I'm gonna just go with the flow. Frank, you're in the food court now. You might want to try mixing different foods in the blenders out there. If you're lucky, you could end up with something really good. I don't see a blender. And you can heat up shit, cook shit. Just gotta find the right stuff. <sighs> Leisure Park. Karate Chop. He does not look intimidating at all in that. I believe there's an achievement for saving. Somebody's barricading the woman clothing shop in Al Fresca Plaza, the place I just left. Guess I'm gonna go try and save these dumbasses or this person, whoever. It's good to give your survivors weapons too, I believe, because. The, the AI in this game is so dumb. Like, incredibly dumb. Yeah. Uh, 
not this door. This door. Damn it, just what I need. Another one of those crazies. Better knock it off, Bert. Oh, now it killed him in one hit. This was not my intention. Unless you're in a hurry, don't follow me. We don't need any extra noise. Just let me go with you. I don't want to die. I'm so sorry, Bert. It was not meant to go down this way. But I'm pretty sure I had to hit him a couple times before. I just should have used my bare hands. Now you want to clear the path a bit for him. And you have to constantly like call them with the Y button. This is on Xbox One version of it, by the way. But you have to constantly call them with the Y button to get them to stay on track. See, I was just standing there until I called him. Come on, Bert. Where you at? I gotta wait till I see that little green thing on his. Or I could just get eight. Come on. I guess I didn't see green thing, but he should be behind me or else I'm gonna be mad. Cause he was standing like two feet away. Okay, yes, he survived. Follow me! Follow me. Did he get hurt any? No, you're still steady. I'm gonna take the sledgehammer. I don't really care for the sledgehammer that much. Like, the fucking AI in this game, they'll literally run away from where you're going to go push a zombie on the ground. Yeah. Okay. Come on. And for here, I try to keep my people stuck on the wall. Like, on this one, I haven't got all the achievements, but on the 360 back in the day, I got every single ass. I can remember uh, my buddy Connor Edgerton stayed up all night with me while I did the... Uh, seven day survivor achievement. I think one of the hardest was answering every phone call from Otis from the game because you have to be in certain spots at certain times and if you you have to save certain survivors and like they, they put a lot of detail in this game. Well a lot of people hate on it because of what how it looks and stuff. It's still one of my favorite games just like I think for its time it was probably damn good. I don't know what year it came out but I imagine it's old because I was a little kid in North Carolina playing it with my, like, family in-laws, or not in-laws, uh, God brother, God brother, yeah, that's the word, but yeah, uh, it was so fucking hard as a kid, oh, my bat's gonna break, Come on. oh, it seems like he's getting, Oh, he's in the middle of a fight. He had it in even here. Come on. Come on, dumbass. Look at that run. It's beautiful, huh? Good. I wonder how distraught he is about his friend. Poor Bert. <laughs> Time to sit here and get ate up. All right, let's see. Oh, I got a sledgehammer. Okay, what I'm gonna do is because I think I gotta go. Actually, you know, I'll just take him back to the security room and come back. And you can get books that boost your shit, like uh, see, see what it does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one says, hold on to interior design goods three times as long. I don't want that though. I found a woman in jewelry shop in Al Fresca Plaza. She's moving around an awful lot. It almost looks like she's looking for somebody. That pisses me off because that's just where I was. 
I, I knew it was coming up, but it was, I didn't want to sit around waiting. Come on! Come on! Come on, Aaron. And you can tell people to wait. You have to really, like, recharge your camera in this. Well, get more footage anyway. Come on! Damn, look at how low that bar is. I'm a triangle saver, but. That's longer. Damn. Path of travel. I can hear the squish on his foot. Huh? Isn't that kind of stupid what though? Step on a wasp or a bee or whatever this game wants to label it as and zombies heads blow up. He could have got poked with the stinger. Come on! Come on, Aaron. We ain't got time for your lollygagging. <laughs> and she, she drops a bee or a queen, whatever it is. Those are good for clearing out crowds and shit, I suppose. You can't do it, Aaron. So sorry about Bart once again. I thought he was a man. He went down so easy. Hmm. So that's what Dr. Barnaby said, huh? The old coot's not dumb. He wants us to call for help first. We gotta line out or what? <sighs> the signal's being blocked. I can't even contact HQ on the emergency line. So, if we want to get our hands on Dr. Barnaby, we're gonna have to secure a way out of here ourselves. All right, we've got to deal with the situation we've been handed. The Boneheads back at HQ might be working on something, too. There's a helicopter coming. Three days from now. At noon, it's my ride. Is your ride reliable? Absolutely. That's how I plan on getting out of here. All right, then. I'll see to it that the DHS picks up the charter fee. Can we take Dr. Barnaby as well? Sure. As long as you tell me what's going on. Okay. I'll tell you what you want to know. Later. We have more pressing business right now. If we have to wait here for three days, we'll need supplies. Uh, water, blankets and the like. We'll get Dr. Barnaby here tomorrow morning. I want you to keep an eye on the monitors. All right, that's case one. So now you get time to kill until 6 a.m. With the zombies going berserk like this, I doubt the professor is going in anywhere until morning. I'm sorry you had to get involved in all this, Frank. You might want to consider spending the night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't need health? Nah. Okay, so now I'm going to go try and save that girl. Never thought I'd get involved in an adventure like this at my age. This is so exciting, I can't sleep. Exciting? I'd be fucking terrified. Maybe, anyway, I don't know. Zombies are kind of weak. Yeah. Damn it. I just need to press the button. Now, I don't know why he takes the trip with the zombies, but he does it, so... 
kudos to him. I could be sitting here killing them, but, oh, but what's the point? I'm just, I'm in a rush. Damn it, when will they open that damn gate? That's not what I wanted, Jesus. There we go. Now I look a little less psycho. Now I look retarded. Rush to this mission. One thing I learned playing, if you don't want to have to rush around and try and save everybody or whatever, you can just, uh, fucking kill the survivors and then not have to worry about it, but, you know, it just depends what you're playing for. Like, there's an achievement for saving 50 survivors or some shit. There's an achievement for saving eight survivors at once, and then there's one for eight female survivors at once. That takes, like, playing halfway through the game to get that one, and you have to do it correct. Like there's one mission in the game, I'm not going to say too much because we'll eventually get to it, but there's like four women together at once, so that covers half of it. And you can only carry eight survivors max at a time. Get out of my motherfucking way! In the next game, they have a ninja suit you can wear. It's so beneficial. Like, zombies don't see you as easily and shit. Alright, let's go save someone. Willamette Parkview Mall. Damn it, they're so fucking annoying. Damn it, oh my goodness. What's the matter? Are you okay? Good. Grace, where's Grace? Look, I love how her hands face through my... My body, Grace, Grace, answer me, where's Grace? I think she said my baby earlier. Oh, get your ass on the floor, bitch. You got separated from your kid? Grace is my baby. I'll find your baby for you, lady. First, let's get you someplace safe. Just leave me alone. They ate her. Those damn zombies ate my baby right in front of me. Oh God, I never thought I'd hear her cry like that. Please just leave me alone. What, you wanna stick around with him? With the ones that ate your little girl? Come on, I'm not gonna let you die here. Thank God I can care. Oh wait, I can't. I can't jump over the thing with her. I gotta get her to come out. Come on. No, nah, I'm getting eight for you, bitch. She's your stupid ass limp. Come on, girl. Come on. Please get out. Come on. There. Now I can carry her. So I mean, it took her like ages to get through. When you're carrying people and holding their hand in this game, you're less likely to get grabbed. Like, you see him still jumping at me, but the chances are a lot slimmer. <laughs> I've been playing for over an hour. Oh, I gotta grab her again. What?
Oh shit. I'm nervous about this. Damn it. I was hoping it wasn't time yet. Right, brother. Yeah. <laughs> All right, looks like he found our next contestant. We're going to take out that dude and snatch his old lady. Damn, get fucked. Don't look so menacing in that scene. Well, see, this just complicated things. Now I have to try and save this girl, fight them, and save that girl. I could just abandon one of them. This one did already lose a daughter. What she got to live for? I don't even see him. Please stop running. Follow me! Come over here, come here. Oh shit. Okay. Now if she follows me, we can get through this alive. Oh, there's those guys. It's okay, we're right here by the door if this bitch can handle her shit. Please hurry. They're giving us a courtesy few minutes. Is she close enough? Okay. Whew. Yeah, that's two people I lost already. One I didn't have a fair chance. Okay. Come on. Oh wait, hold on. I need to check something. Thank you Go. very much. Oh shit, this is the one I need to go do. You guys stay down here. If I miss this one, I miss kind of a big part of the game. I mean, not really, but I think that's important. But unfortunately, I think cutscenes are gonna take away that marker and then I'll have to go rescue them. <laughs> hey you, you're in my way. Can't you see I'm hard at work? I'm trying to take some pictures here. You got a nice camera there yourself, but don't you know, but you don't know the first thing about photography, do you? Good. Think you're a professional, huh? Right, gotcha. Don't you really appreciate the weight of the word professional carries around? If you don't have the talent, you can't use the word just blah, 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 whatever. The name's Frank West. Sorry, I got in the way of shot. I'll just get out of your hair now. Okay, okay, hang on a sec, buddy. Why don't I do you a favor? I'll have a look at your technique and give you some pointers. Don't be shy now, Frankie. Here, I'll even model for you. Show me what you can do and I'll be the judge. What a great idea, huh? Sometimes I think I'm a genius. Let's get started. Shit, okay, it's starting a cutscene or something, so I gotta go round up those gals. Okay, first I want you to take a picture. You have to get 500 pp for my image. This probably would have fucked up the marker anyway.
Red eyes, black dragon. Get your asses back where I said to be. Here, take this. Oh, I can't give him weapons. Oh well. Alright, what do you want me to I gotta get a picture worth yeah, 500. Yeah. Keep it up, old timer. Oh, he got a good shot. Oh, you stupid bitch, you moved up for a shot. Try a little harder, old timer. Damn, he's pissing me off. Over here, old man. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm struggling. Give me a sec. Fantastic. That should have been good enough. How peculiar does it have to be? Then there we go. Perfect. Oh yeah, great. Fantastic. You old sack of crap. Great shot. Fantastic. Damn it, so yeah, close. Yeah. Keep it up, old timer. Do your stupid pose again. Oops, I was gonna do it. Oh well, maybe Over that counts. Here, old man. Oh yeah, great! Then Yeah, there we go. Great shot. Cause the credit goes to your model. Hmm. Well, it's in focus. And uh the composition's okay, I suppose. Uh-huh. Hmm. That ain't half bad. Okay, here comes the next one, Frankie. But first. Feast your eyes on my work. Now this is my most emotionally moving shot. <laughs> now this is my sexiest shot. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> okay, okay. This is my most violent shot. Check it out. Ugh. So I get that okay, shit out my face. Here's the deal, Frankie. You gotta go out there and take even better pictures than the ones I just showed you. You think you can handle that, huh? Yeah. Yeah. And he just walks off. Okay. Oh, it moved my location above them. Time to go secure the women. Come on! Come on! Better save it when I get back up there. Might even call this the video. Come on! Come on! Cam's camera. All right, so, so far 
Only one we lost was Bart. I'm gonna clear this hallway before I even. Yeah, 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 yeah. Who's the hand? Watch this. In his mouth. Yeah, sometimes you just gotta clear the path because these fuckers are dumb. And you never know, this could be full of shit. Yeah, see. This is a good time for a B. Oh shit. Oh shit, get back out here. Why are you hiding back there? Alright, let's get her ass. Follow me! Here we go. Oh shit, three missed calls. I, I got, and you can't, I, I hate that you can't much. fucking walk up there with them. Fantastic! Come on, you cripples. That's probably close enough. I can never forget about my darling Grace, so I guess I have to something, something, something. You guys are lucky enough to just pause it if you want. Well, I reckon I'm gonna save it and make this that video, but I might just right, right away record another one I don't know just yet. All right. Well, if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe for more. I own nothing and play only for entertainment. Thanks for watching.